The superior capsule reconstruction is a technique to address the massive irreparable rotator cuff tear. The arthroflex dermal allograft in this technique will span the superior glenoid and humeral tuberosity to help reduce superior translation and improve glenohumeral joint kinematics. The superior glenoid and humeral tuberosity bone beds are prepared and two 3mm biocomposite suture tack anchors are inserted percutaneously into the superior glenoid just medial to the superior labrum and two biocomposite swivel lock anchors preloaded with fiber tape are inserted into the greater tuberosity spanning the defect. A 10 mm passport cannula is used in the lateral portal to help with suture management and graft passage. An arthroscopic measuring probe is used to measure the distances between the anchors. These four measurements are recorded and used to shape the arthroflex graft. Small holes are made in the arthroflex graft at the corresponding anchor locations to simplify suture passage and ease suture sliding when positioning the graft. The fiber wire sutures are systematically retrieved through the passport cannula and passed through the corresponding holes in the graft. Careful attention to suture management is critical at this point to avoid suture twists while retrieving and passing the sutures. The medial glenoid anchors and sutures are used as a pulley to help position the graft into place. One of the suture strands from each anchor are tied together over the graft. A kingfisher tissue grasper is used to advance the graft through the passport cannula and into the glenohumeral space. Tensioning the opposing suture strands will pull and position the graft onto the superior glenoid. A knotless labral swivel lock can be used to fixate the medial sutures, or as an alternative, the two fiber wire suture limbs can be tied using a static surgeon's knot. Once the medial side is complete, the humeral side is fixated using a standard knotless speed bridge repair to maximize fixation strength and enhance footprint compression between the graft and bone. Margin convergence sutures are added posteriorly between the arthroflex and remaining rotator cuff tissue. Anterior sutures can be added, but care should be taken not to overconstrain the interval. The completed superior capsule reconstruction helps reduce superior humeral translation and improve shoulder kinematics by anatomically replacing the superior capsule.